et lot zu sax. Dear, dear, dear. I've no idea what all that's about, but there you are. We ask you to tell us what's on your mind, and you do it. One three hundred five six four six five two. Norman, are you there? Norman. Yeah, there I am last week. <laughs> oh, we've got the real living Norman. Now, listen to me. There I am sitting there last week before Anzac Day. Yeah. And up on the TV comes Anzac Day, an Anzac record, yeah. narrated by John Laws. Yeah. Did you get paid for that? I can't remember. I don't think so. No, I did. did you get paid for that? I'm uh, asking you. You uh, do, you uh, don't. Uh, hang on a minute, Norman. Don't get smart with me. I answered the question I don't remember, and that is a truthful oh, yeah, answer. Your, your mind's going again, John. Yeah, probably, I probably. You, I, I hope you didn't get... Then that would be the height of money-grubbing, if you would take money for narrating an Anzac record. Yes, Why I doubt... Why didn't you donate your time? I, I, hang on, Norman. I doubt very much that I did get paid for it, any more than I get paid for the ode that I do for many RSL clubs all over Australia. I read the, the ode. At the well, going down of the sun and in the morning, we will remember them... I'm I'm sure you know the Ode, Ode being a good uh, ex-serviceman, as I'm sure you are. Hey, so they wanted to sell the record, so they got your... They put your face on the record, too. <laughs> there you are. Your face was on the corner of the record. I thought, oh, my God. He's taken money for an Anzac Day record. He didn't, couldn't donate his time for that. I, I probably did donate my time. Hey, and on the record, it said John Law's CBE. Is that right? Yeah. You know what? I bet you want Abbott to get into power so he could make you a sir. So they bring back the... the like New Zealand, <laughs> when the Conservatives got in power over there, hey, he bring back the, the peerages and all those sort of things. He'd be, Sir John Laws. Oh, wouldn't that... Oh, that'd take the cake. That'd be Lady Laws. Hey, oh, then you could drive around in your rolls and you'd be... Sir John, oh, all oh, 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 your, oh, your, oh, your, um, your lady oh, here, they, would, they would have to curtsy for you. Dear. They would have to curtsy. Oh, I they, think by the sound of your voice, you'd do that anyway, Norman. They, they'd have to curtsy in their skirts for Sir John. You bring that at Tony out of it. Say, are you going to bring back the sirs and the ladies and the dames? I don't know. I don't, in, no, I don't think he's... He's straight away, no, mate. No, no he's not going to do that. But listen, this will really aggravate you. I have uh, an OBE as well as a CBE. So I'm a commander of the British Empire, and I also am a commander under the order of the British Empire. OBE, CBE. That would really infuriate you. Oh, yeah. Oh, you, you really deserve that, John, for I... sitting down for three hours a day on your bum, <laughs> talking, talking rubbish and getting paid millions of dollars. You are... Oh, you know, all these other people... You know, community service, they're getting these honours, but you get it for sitting on your bum for three hours. Now listen, <laughs> hey, on TV... No, I didn't, no, I didn't get it to that, but anyway. Oh, yes, you did. On TV, no, I didn't. On TV, there's Alex Wilmer doing these depend ads for the nappies, and they see there's a men's vet. I bet you'll be the man. <laughs> you'll be on TV. You'll do the... Oh, now, Norman, ads. as you know, it'll all depend on the money. Yeah, it all depends on the money. Depend <laughs> nappies, depend John. I can see you there saying, oh, these, because I leak a bit. <laughs> you old smart. Hey, isn't it good now that school holidays is finished? You won't have all these kids ringing up trying to get watches off you so they can give it to their parents. Do you think these kids really want watches for themselves? Listen, Norman. Does your watch, no, does excuse your me, excuse me, Norman. Answer the question. Why do you listen to the program? Listen to me, John. No, is you listen to me, Norman, you moron. Why do you why do you listen to the program? Is your face on the watches? Uh yeah, I think it is. Oh I don't know, it's a while since I yes, I think so. Your and I'll tell you what, all the ladies all the ladies wear them with pride. Your face is on the actual watch. Yeah, so when you when you look at the time they You see, see your John. Face. You see oh. John's little smiling face. Oh and you think these kids who ring up all these nice kids that ring up, all these cattle kids all ring up, they, they want them for themselves. Are you sure they... The, those kids would go to school and they'd say, look, I've got a job. The kids would tan them, wouldn't they? They ring I it up. They're no, using no, you. No, 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 no. I get on very well with the kids. No, no. The parents are using the kids to ring up John Laws to get, and get a, a watch. watch. Yes. Yeah, well, I, do, I don't mind. You, I don't mind if they. I don't mind uh, if they're doing that. Then you have to bribe your listeners to ring up <laughs> to get a watch. Hey, no. everybody out there who's got a child, ring up John Laws. He'll give you a watch. 
Those kids don't want a watch off you. They don't want your bloody head on it. Please. You're kidding me. And this, when you go on holiday soon, John, have you looked at the Virgin? Does that restrict your, you know, your looking where you go on a holiday, seeing that you don't go Qantas anymore? Does that restrict you, you know, because I know you go on Virgin for a free flight. Does that yeah, you know, hang, you on, hang, on, hang on, Norman. What are you talking about? Free flights on Virgin? Yeah, because now you promote Virgin now. I don't, get, I don't get free flights on anybody. No, nah, no, look, you've dumped And Qantas. when I, hang, hang on, when yeah. I go overseas, I'm flying Emirates. Oh, oh well, that's right, because remember that, you know, the, the drinking situation, I understand that. Why don't you go to Virgin? <laughs> eh? Because that's your, you know, you dumped oh, Qantas to go to Virgin. Uh, listen, like, Norman, know, I, did, I didn't... Uh, I didn't. I didn't dump anybody. I don't make any money out of Virgin. I read the ads because they pay this radio station to have the ads there. So I read them. Oh, I have a. I have a job to do. Hey, John, you get paid in in, in contra. You know, free flight. No, I, you know, like, no, like no, when, no, I don't. No, I like don't. Norman. Dump, like when you oh, look, Nor Norman. Norman. Yes. Just, just get out of my life, will you? Just get out of my life. You like really, you, you like really you, are a pain in the uh, ass. Like you, you, there was, a, there was a time, life. there was a time when you were kind of a little bit entertaining, but now you're just, uh, you're just a pain in the neck. I can't be bothered with you, Norman. Please desist in ringing this program.